Well, welcome back to Big Boy. We're looking at next war, Vietnam, GMT, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, top of turn two, I, I had uh, taken a little break here because I was digging into Quattro Bra and was doing some, a bunch of other stuff and uh, had not had the mental energy to, to grasp what was going on or, or dig in on uh, next war. And I'm glad I took the break because when I came back, I went back over my VP VP counts and the and the points that you get to allocate to each side based on the choices you make for some of the optionals like getting extra aircraft and uh, maybe the uh, the Chinese do the coup de main and 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 take these two islands and, and all that sort of fun stuff. So I went back through that and realized that I had uh, miscalculated the VPs. And part of the reason why I was reluctant to kind of jump back into the game is because I, I looked, it looked like that the Allies were already rolling for auto victory on turn two. And I was thinking, man, you know, I'm not even going to get a chance to get all the units into the game before it's over. So fortunately, I'd made a significant mistake somewhere along the way. And I don't know where, and it doesn't really matter. It could have just been bumping counters on the VP track. And so... Uh, Here's the, here's the deal, here's the update, I guess, for, from the gameplay. Uh, there's a 15 victory point minimum in order for it to be an initiative turn versus a contested turn. And I went back and looked at the losses. There was a, a Vietnamese, a South Vietnamese, or South Vietnamese, a Vietnamese division uh, eliminated. That's three VPs right there. And then I, I had, uh, you know, inadvertently selected to eliminate weaker units of air that took losses when uh, some of the bases were damaged and destroyed. Oh, that reminds me, is that, does that count for uh, capture or destroy an enemy controlled airfield? Ah, so that's gonna be one more, plus one, so it's gonna be, ooh, close, 14. Uh, because we had one destroyed, uh, so they missed it by one. <laughs> so. Anyway, I had these air units over here that I had eliminated and I, I went back and looked at it. It's like, you know what, it would have been stupid to do that unless it was the uh, attacker's choice and it was not the attacker's choice. So um, uh, for, 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 the, for the roles that we made for, for those base damage, the, the base damage that occurred. So I put those two dead units back and flipped two other units to represent the four steps that would have been lost, <clears throat> saving us four VPs, right? So that was good. But where we had gotten to, because of what, whatever inadvertent error I'd made, is that we had 70 VPs on the tally, and really it should have been <laughs> well, 46, or actually now uh, 47. I'll make a note of that before I forget. 47. So uh, that's a big difference, right? And not only that, uh, the it would not be an initiative turn uh, for the Chinese in the second turn, as far as I can tell anyway, uh, because they got 14 VPs instead of 15 VPs. This then means that we're in a much, much closer sort of uh, uh, conflict or battle here than I expected. And the other thing is too, that uh, I think it gives us a chance to get some of the forces into the game uh, and instead of it being kind of a, a, a wipeout. Now, what I elected to do in, in my gameplay was not put the, the, uh, the allied air up in the first turn. Uh, we will probably think about putting some air up this turn because I do have these guys uh, available. There's not a lot there, but I also have these forces here. And I think I can put my uh, I can put my um, I can put my carrier base stuff up as well. So that might be an interesting battle. Although, as you can see here, there is a, just a boatload of Chinese air. And I'm a little reluctant to, to blow through the Vietnamese Air Force at this early juncture of the game. I'm trying to husband my resources. And I, I think my, my, my fighters, my fighter bomber, uh, ground attack aircraft can probably hold their own to a certain extent. 
uh, you know, when they try, if they try and do ground support. But we'll see. So far, I haven't really needed, didn't miss it in the first turn because the Chinese offensive really bogged down here uh, pretty, pretty hard. Did not get very far at all in turn one, really. And, and the same over here, while there was some pretty decent progress over on this side of the map, uh, they're picking up, they're picking up smaller locations. And let me just check that again as well. Capture enemy control city. That doesn't count for VPs, I don't believe. Yeah, the biggest VP count is these two island groups. So anyway, there was some, was some, you know, kind of decent progress here, but they, they got stymied by those two defend, those two units in the, in the jungle there. Um, these, the Spratleys here and the other island underneath, I can't read what that one is. What is it? Oh, that's the Spratleys. Uh, Paracels here. Uh, they're five VPs a turn. So the Allies have to, have to go. They made it into this zone. They have to now invade this island and, and retake it. They have to, because uh, it's, it's, that'll, that'll slow down the VP acquisition. Otherwise, Three turns, we're going to be at 70 points plus whatever else we start demolishing on the map uh, and it's going to be game over. So they're really taking, I guess, uh, the risk on the chin here and I think we'll end up having maybe having a decent naval battle here as well, which I haven't really had that uh, much experience with. So I'm excited about that as well. So we're going to do the air phase now and then we're going to do the soft. Uh, I started doing the turn and, uh, and it was supposed to be the initial. I thought it was an initiative turn. So I was doing uh, the Chinese uh, uh, special forces stuff. They had, uh, we had one detection and lost two special forces units. So they took a bit of a beating and uh, and I've not done, uh, not done uh, the Allied uh, Special Forces stuff yet because we're a little bit out of sequence. We're going to go back and do the air, then we'll do the Special Forces, and we'll kind of go out from there. Well, that took a long time to update, but I just, uh, I'm kind of uh, enthused about the gameplay here now because I, it's not as dire. It's still pretty bad, but it's not as dire as I thought it would be. Uh, I've got some uh, other, some air assets moved into into this, this, this archipelago and, uh, and the Philippines and, and Indonesia over here on the, on the left. And we're, we're going to try and go have some fun with some of those guys uh, in the next few minutes. So it looks like my camera is just deciding to sag. I think this uh, stand is uh, not having a happy time of, its, of, it, uh, of it at the moment. All right, going to roll. Dice. Talk to you soon.